Did you spend hundreds, if not thousands of dollars on your VR handset? You played Beat Saber for 30 hours, a little bit of VR chat, and you go, you know what? I want to watch Matt Watson's VR concert. I want to watch one of those roller coaster videos in VR. I want to watch insert stupid ass video here. But every single video player you use is either just a virtual flat screen or it switches a 2D video out and it looks like complete or sh well, fellas. Uh, that was me about like a month ago, but luckily I know what to do, so I'm gonna help you guys out. What you're gonna do is you just wanna go to uh, the Opera download page. You scroll to the bottom, archive versions, and you wanna go Control F. And what you wanna do is you wanna download this uh, specific version 25 or 55 rather. This is the version I used previously, and I had no problems, so this is the one I will continue using. I'll put it in the description. Click on that. Opera 64, nice. Click on that, go to options, and I'm gonna uncheck these boxes because I don't want them. Uh, and then copy this path, and then click accept and install. Then what you're, what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna open up your little file browser, okay? And you're gonna wanna paste in that link right here. You're gonna wanna go to the version, scroll down, and you're gonna see these, all these Opera auto update stuff. Auto updates, these are poison. You don't want these, okay? Because the newer version, this feature doesn't work. Close, close the browser. Go back here, okay? You'll see now it created this folder too. You want to delete that as well. You can just double click on that launcher.exe, about Opera, 55 baby. That's what you want, that's what you want. Now what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna type inside Opera, colon, slash, slash, flags slash and you're gonna go to the search and you're gonna look up VR and you'll see media VR enable web VR enable uh, just enable all of it mindlessly because uh, I mean you might need all of them it might not you can just go through these settings and actually pick ones that you want but I'm just gonna say all of them because uh, it doesn't hurt and then once you're done that you can just check this go to your settings and you can just search VR and you'll see that enable 360 VR video is already there. Let's just go to YouTube. VR 360 Matt Watson. Finally, you're living out your dream. Okay. It's like the highest quality that it allow you. Look at this. Watching VR. You click on that, and um, and your handy little Oculus app will load up. It'll it'll start loading up there. Look at that. Done. It it works. Good. I can't actually show you what it looks like inside the handset because Oculus doesn't let, doesn't let you record that, but it works. Trust me. And this will work on any video on YouTube, not just VR videos. It'll work on any video on the internet. Period. Just click the VR button when you're on your headset in virtual desktop, and there you go. Easy peasy, living greasy. See you guys next time.